are headed to mule deer camp. Gavin won our mule deer hunt giveaway last year at the trade shows. Uh, Nick, his dad, actually won, but he wanted his son to have the tag, so that's what we're doing. It's going to be fun. Uh, Jeremy's going to meet me there. I going off a couple hours of sleep. Got up early this morning and jammed all the way over East River to hunt this morning. Didn't have any luck. A couple close calls and now I'm heading west. But should be a good time. Uh, the next three days we have slotted to hunt if needed. So guess we'll just see what shakes out. There's been a lot of deer in that area so I hope that they stuck around and maybe something big showed up. We'll get camp situated and those guys will meet us in the morning and we're going to go try to shoot a big mule deer. But hopefully Gavin can put a bullet in a big boy. We will see. Just got out to our lease. I'm just gonna drive around in the glass this evening. There's lots of high points you can see good from. There's a couple white tailed does down here in this bottom, but that's about it so far. A few mule deer does way over on the far hill. Trying to find a big boy. Uh, back out in the prairie for a giveaway hunt. Travis is out here already scouting. I just arrived, I'm gonna go scout. I just saw a buck from, I don't know, two miles away where I'm going to scout. So I'll hopefully be able to get a better look at him. He looked like he might've been decent. I'm gonna go get some uh, warm clothes on and get after it, see what we can see. Well, seen a lot of deer tonight. A couple pretty good ones I think in the distance Jeremy was moving in to get a closer look at quite a few white tails too which is good to see them starting to try to bounce back at least after two years of EHD in a row but see what else we see before dark First night at camp, Jeremy's on Dilla duty. Like normal, all Dilla duty. I am really beer. proud of you, you cracked a beer before me. That is the first time. With a ginormous spatula. Whatever works. It's really cold out, so the Blackstone is um, vacant at the moment and we're cooking inside. We're gonna have some supper. We got our TV running because we're idiots and we thought our radio was broken but it was just the dimmer switch. Don't tell people that. So, <laughs> we are idiots. I was like, man, I, I have so much faith in Team Lodge, I can't believe the radio is broken. Well, it wasn't. They put it together how it's supposed to be. We are just idiots and there's a dim button and if you hit it one too many times it blacks out. We thought it burnt out. I'm kind of embarrassed to admit that. but. Yeah, we're gonna. I have not have told anyone that myself. But. Yeah, I know, but you know, it is what it is. Nick and Gavin are meeting us tomorrow morning. They're probably driving out right now, so it's gonna be fun. Saw a ton of deer tonight. Nothing real big, but a lot of deer, so that's a good start, anyhow. Hopefully, we can find a shooter in the morning. 
Good morning guys. It is Gavin's hunt today. Just getting ready. It's warm. It warmed up a lot overnight because last night when I got here it was like 12 degrees and now it's 25. The high is 41 today. So that's a pleasant little change. Not that I mind the cold this time of year because it's better for hunting. But We're just getting the hunt worth on. I've switched to my medium weight pants today and got my Shelton hoodie on. I'm gonna wear my probably like the lighter heat boost coat I think for the morning at least. But Jeremy's going base layer and lightweight pants because he's tougher than me. Uninsulated boots today. Oh yeah the uninsulated boots <laughs> and pretty much guaranteed loss. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> it is Sunday. <laughs> I picked him to win, though. We're going to go meet up with Nick and Gavin and get after it. So we'll see you out there. Well, we are with Gavin and Nick. What up? Gavin's Morning. got the tag. We met these guys at the Iowa show, and they had uh, bought some stuff from us and signed up for the hunt giveaway. And we pulled Nick's name, and he had Gavin get the tag, which is super cool. We're just heading out now. So we're gonna see if we can find a big old mule deer this morning. Well, we have three days, so we'll see how long it takes, but we're gonna find a big one that Jeremy didn't find last weekend. Hopefully. And we're gonna shoot it. How's that sound? Let's do this. Awesome, let's go. <laughs> let's go. Get if you can. Nice. He's a good one. He's better than the other one. I was gonna yeah. shoot for sure. Holy Ooh, got it. Oh! Yeah. Yeah. Build the story right there. Yes. Awesome. Holy cow! I think he died right behind that tree. 
Oh yeah, that I think so. Good. I hit him that both times. That was crazy. You guys were right with the dough. Oh yeah. Came up. They'll hold pretty tight with the dough. I figured oh, he yeah. had to be hey, right there. Hey, thanks for the use of your gun. Yeah, holy cow, <laughs> like man. It's sighted in for sure. It's yeah. good, yeah. Boom, man. Flip, guys. I was standing a little bit in front of you, and it has a muzzle brake on it. Did you jump? And my right ear <laughs> is no longer working at the moment, but that's okay. <laughs> I almost feel bad. I almost feel bad though. Oh, oh no! God. No! Yeah. Do not. <laughs> that that crazy. Is I've shot. I've shot a couple white tails. Well, know. we got plenty of time. So. Yeah, yeah, we got a couple of days. We wouldn't want to shoot one right away and be done. I like, know. What fun is that? Yeah. You didn't even look over the ranch. Yet. <laughs> Dude, There's you know what's funny? Shot. I looked hey. down here and I thought that was a rib cage. So did I. And then I looked up and there was a doe standing there. He was moving on that, that first was, that shot. That was a yearling like, doe too. That was so far. He wasn't. Yeah, was he wasn't gonna doe, stop. Yeah. Yeah. He wasn't gonna stop. He wasn't moving that far, and I'm oh. like, ah, I better oh, yeah. take it now. <laughs> Dang right. <laughs> Smashed him. I think you hit him on the second shot too. I did. Yeah. You hit him on all of them mostly. Um. So now we gotta figure out how to get over there. Yeah. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> It's solid four by five. Heck yeah. Ooh. Congratulations. <laughs> awesome buck, man. That is nice. Man, it's sure gonna be fun dragging him across this creek by yourself, ain't it? <laughs> See ya. We're off See you later. <laughs> Well, Gavin's gun. Yep. Jeremy's hey, gonna have to. Your gun. <laughs> what you? You stole three bullets from him. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> but we got him drug out of the creek bottom, and we're walking back to the truck now. Well, go have a little lunch. Jeremy's buck in here, and it is Gavin's turn. Yes, sir. It's gonna go down. I'll put him in here while. Uh... We're already bloody. Okay. Makes sense. I'm not bloody. I'll get him in here while he's not bloody. <laughs> Mariah's on that wide one. Last year, I am afraid to admit that I never shot it after I traded it from a buddy. I just trusted him, and it worked. So that was the very first time I shot it, and then today I shot your gun for the first time. I Which one was your favorite? The seven mm. <laughs> <laughs> it did the most damage. Yeah, that's for sure. Definitely did the most damage. I, you know what? At the end of the day, as long as it goes bang and hits where I'm aiming, I'm happy with it. Put a hole in it. Which one are you gonna use next year? <laughs> Who knows. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder you haven't killed a hills deer. You gotta borrow someone's gun. Yeah, no kidding. You can take my one of mine if you want. I shot my dad, my elk with my dad's borrowed seven millimeter. Cause all I have is two forty three. Now I have a three hundred that I'll never use for elk. Like maybe in fifteen years. Yep, you're kind of an idiot. Hey, here's the deal. I'm such a good shot <laughs> that I can shoot with any rifle. Yeah. Uh -huh. I don't. It doesn't need to be <laughs> mine. Give me a give me a boomstick, and we're hitting where we're aiming. Mm -hmm. I should stop. I still have tags to fill. I'm you're gonna, guaranteed missing you're the hills, yourself, dude. Jeremy, you're gonna jinx yourself. I know. Well, we got a little lunch in us, and we are back out now, looking for a big mule deer for Gavin back there. Yep. I think it's gonna go down. We all got some energy. Yep, got it's some going down. Blood on our hands and. Uh, Broke the old ice. I think uh, the time is going to be near. But first, we just got to find the one, so stay tuned. Well, we 
we spotted a good one and we got into the closest position we can and now we're going to sneak up there and try to put a bullet in him. Nice, really nice deer to get on his first mule deer buck. So, see if it comes together. those guys down I just spotted a good buck bedded great buck for Gavin's first mule deer it's a good representation of a mule deer he's got all of his forks not a huge scorer but just a really solid buck under the circumstances that we're dealing with right now so just a ton of young deer on this property nothing super old and mature I'm not sure how old or young this guy is he's probably not real old but you know, management's out the window when somebody's after their first buck. Hopefully uh, we can put one in him. He's bedded at about 240 yards. It's kind of windy, so we'll crawl up to the edge of this rim and try to get one, get one put in him and put him down. Him. He never even moved. Woo! Yes! <laughs> yes! Yeah, <buddy>. Woo! <laughs> yes! 
Oh. Holy cow! Awesome. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! That was a nice shot, oh. 250 yards. Oh! Travis! Hey, hey that was Travis. awesome, guys. Hey. Let's go! <laughs> Woo! That was amazing, folks! <laughs> Woo! I love it. I love it. Woo! Got him. There, first meal. Yes. <laughs> nice work. Five by five. Well, that's a wrap. Jeremy shot that buck this morning, and then Gavin. Piled up his first mule deer over here. Oh, damn. Woo. Bingo. Boom. He's down. But it was a fun day. Congratulations, yeah. man. It was Thank fun you guys. with you guys. Yeah, it was crazy hot, man. We're uh, done a couple days early, which is both good and bad. Bad because we have to leave now. Yeah. But good because we had success. So you can't complain about that. Nope, can't. But yeah, it's been fun. Get everything slowly loaded up and we're all gonna hit the road tonight so been a good time team lodge the little house on the prairie set up we got some trailers next door these are our neighbors but it's fun nick we had a good time man yeah great Remember time me? it was awesome 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 yeah, stuff thank you guys enough it was awesome oh, out you here. Bet. Yeah. beautiful place so it was a good time you guys. Kind, kind enough to let me break the ice. Yep. <laughs> we got two nice bucks down. Can't beat that. Yeah, Monday dang down. right. Wow. Great day. Yeah. Great day, sun setting, nice view. Hard to beat. Now you guys got time to get back east and lay down. Yep. Know. Yeah. Now to go to East River. Dang right. Good luck, man. Yeah, yeah thank, thank you guys. You. Yeah, you thank bet. Thank you so much, Travis. Absolutely. Have a safe trip home and. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and we'll see you next time.